understanding the phrase, lovers torn apart. Hello, everyone. In today's video, we're going to explore a very evocative and poetic phrase in the English language, lovers torn apart. This phrase is rich in meaning and emotion, and understanding it can enhance your appreciation of English literature, movies, and everyday conversation. Let's dive into the world of this beautiful yet heart-wrenching expression. Lovers torn apart literally refers to two people in love who have been separated. The word lovers signifies two people who have deep romantic feelings for each other. The term torn apart suggests a forceful or unwilling separation. It's important to note that this separation is often perceived as beyond the lover's control, caused by external circumstances or societal pressures. Beyond its literal meaning, lovers torn apart carries a deep emotional weight. It often conveys feelings of sadness, longing, and a sense of tragedy. In literature and film, this phrase is used to evoke empathy and emotional connection from the audience. It can also imply a hope for reunion or a lament for a love that could have been but never was. This phrase is a common trope in literature, movies, and songs. It's used to describe a wide range of scenarios, from historical tales of star-crossed lovers to modern stories of relationships strained by distance or circumstance. Understanding this phrase can enhance your appreciation of these narratives and the emotional journeys they depict. Let's look at some examples. 1. Historical Romance in a story set during a war, two lovers are separated as one is sent to battle. 2. Modern drama. In a contemporary setting, a couple might be torn apart by career opportunities in different cities. 3. Fantasy. In a fantasy world, two lovers could be separated by an ancient curse or a feud between magical families. These examples show how versatile and powerful the phrase, lovers torn apart, can be in storytelling. I hope this video has helped you understand the phrase, lovers torn apart, and its significance in English. Whether you encounter it in a book, a movie, or a conversation, you'll now be able to appreciate the depth of emotion and storytelling it conveys. Thank you for watching. And I look forward to sharing more interesting English phrases with you in future videos.